Hello world, I'm Cap. Welcome to Call This Simulator Unflinching Order, where this time we are gonna go for a forge cult, for a forge victory. And we're gonna start as the detective this time, because, well, we haven't done that before, so... The detective is a tiny bit different than the other things, and... I remember the first time I played as the detective, because I haven't played as the detective that much. Uh, let's actually be called Detective Carp here. Uh... Yeah, the first time I played, I won a minor victory without ever managing to actually start my cult. So, this is a bit different. Okay, let's look at our inspector's position. I have a senior position in the capital's police force. Okay, so let's work with that. At the station. Once again, I have been sec seconded to the Suppression Bureau, the government office which concerns itself with occult crimes. The Bureau has a poor reputation. Yeah, well, they usually don't manage to get... <laughs> Get that many uh, convictions happening, at least when I'm playing. Be wary. The Bureau has identified a troublesome individual I am to investigate. My breath tightens when I see the name. There was another case, one I remember all too well. So we get some funds, we get a sealed Bureau file, and who also do we get? Saliba, long in the making. Saliba does not tolerate boredom. Also, Saliba has aspect a rival's sentient at four. And once this gets to... What does it say? Seven. He can win. So that's the thing about the inspector. It starts with uh, a rival, and the rival starts at level four. So you can lose by just uh, well losing to the rival. We're also dreaming right now. The suppression bureau publishes memoranda on the dangers of dreams. Every week there's another, and time is passing as well. Okay, so. We could work on the sealed bureau file. Burn the file. This is evidence. We don't burn evidence, but perhaps it is for the best. Okay, let's not burn it though. Uh, so we can work here for Saliba with some reason. Some more reason. And with some more reason. Well, let's just pursue this investigation here right now. Investigating a target. The more reason I use, the better my chance of success. But if we manage to capture Saliba here, I don't think we can get him into our cult at all at any point, which is kind of unfortunate. But then again, it's just he's, he's just a Grail person. Grail persons are like the least important persons. Report dreams of moonlight. Report dreams of a nightbound forest. Draw back your curtains to be woken by the sun. Do not cut your hair before you sleep. Never sleep before a cracked mirror. So we get a bit of passion. Okay, so we could dream. Oh, hey, we can dream on the sealed bureau file. No, we can't. Hmm. A file on the enigmatic Mrs. Carp. I sealed it myself. I'm all too familiar with its contents. If I were to revisit them, the dreams might begin again. Yeah, I want the dreams to begin again. Uh, well, let's dream with passion. I know this dream. A road crests a hilltop, and the air is silver bright. And can we dream about? No, we cannot dream about that. We need to dream about lore to find our way to the woods, but we do not have that lore. Now, I don't remember at all how to get the cult cult started in the detective mode. Like, where's our research? Where's our exploration? How do we get them? Well, there's our research. Now and then, I have a little time to improve myself. Okay, progress! The constant clatter of closing doors, the damp stains on the station walls, the smell of boot polish and unwashed constables. All this narrows to a single crystalline truth. I made progress and earned myself some overtime pay. Yeah, we get some extra funds and we get some tentative evidence now. And once again, there's nothing more for us to really do except to work with our inspector's position or with these. And we do not burn these, no. I do not believe we want to burn those at all want to do something good with them. So let's work with uh, Saliba a bit more. No, can I work with the evidence this year? Pursuing an investigation. If I apply my reason, perhaps I can learn more about my target. Well, our reason is dimmed right now, so let's work with our health. Maybe can get a couple of vitalities to start with and increase our health immediately. That would be kind of kind of nice. Okay, so there's our exploration. There's also the scent of the pages. What hungers drive me? Okay, we studied a reason for ourselves and exploring. I have a map of the capital on the wall of my office, bristling with dark-headed pins, spidery with annotations. 
it's okay. So we're gonna get one uh, health, no, uh, vitality from working here. So if we just uh, research our health here uh, immediately as well, we get another vitality and we can immediately increase our health. Hey, there's our talk verb. Nice. Exploring. I know this city well, but it would take a lifetime to know it completely. So we find the Ecdysis Club. The scent of the page. I cannot forget what I saw in the file on Mrs. Cobb. It is difficult to resist rereading the file. Add reason to strengthen your resistance. No, I want to read the file. I don't want to add reason there. Because I want to start my own cult. Uh, we cannot do anything with this here right now. I mean, we could go to the Street Stranger or the Ecdysis Club. But we have no reason to do either one of those. You know what, I haven't gone to the Street Strange in a long time, let's just see what happens. Explore an uncanny tangle of streets by the light of the moon. Streets are strange in the hour called Maniscape. Okay, there, ooh, there is a vitality for us. I dreamt of nothing at all. I woke and stretched and rose without haste. Uh, those quiet hours have left me energized. Okay, so that's good. Now, well, now we have an extra... Uh, vitality, but that doesn't really matter. And there's really nothing else to dream about right here. Yeah, dream of fun, so we could dream of pat reason, but there's no real need to do that. Oh, the wrong kind of attention. Right. Interesting. So, internal investigations, I think. Okay, get some more vitality there. Let's work on our inspector's precision. We'll grab the evidence. We'll put all of our reason in here. And see what happens. Okay, nothing happens with the wrong kind of attention, and we find fascination from the Street Strange. Yep, you shouldn't really ex ever explore the Street Strange by moonlight. I don't think you can get like, well, you can find, I think, contentment from them and fascination, so that's like, why would you ever do that? Okay, can we talk to Saliba? Yes, we can. Arrange a meeting on neutral ground. Are we enemies? Perhaps we don't have to be. And can we talk to you about anything? Well, we can talk to you about stuff. Let's talk to you about the Ecdysis Club, or I don't know, about funds, about the Street Strange. None of this change anything. So we'd really need some lore, or we'd need a temptation to talk to him about anything uh, actually worthwhile. I've neglected my studies, but I stand a little straighter. Okay, so we got some vitality, so let's increase our health now that we have some vitality. And what do we get from here? The scent of the pages. The pages turn so easily. It's like peeling a fruit or unwrapping a secret gift. At the end of it, my hands are stained with ink. My brain boils. What have I begun? So we get a temptation sensation. I could achieve experience of an intensity if you could imagine. This card will allow you to win a sensation victory. We are not gonna do that. Dreaming about it might advance or change it. That is what we are gonna do though. Okay, trembling in the air also started from that, which is kind of unfortunate, but hey, we have some dread here, so we can at least dream one of these fascinations away before it goes there. Oh, right, there's our dreaming. Let's dream that we're also going to want to dream this temptation away. Uh, what if we talk to Saliba about this temptation? Let's see what that does. I mean, it changed the text here, so. Do you propose we make common cause? Are you serious? Yes, that's exactly what I'm proposing. Also, let's go explore the city, because we're gonna want to find... Oh, sickness. So we're gonna want to find some places. Progress! The constant clatter of closing doors, the damp stains on the station walls, the smell of bad polish, boot polish, and oh, this is the same text as it was before. So we get some extra funds, and we get damning evidence. Now, the weird thing about this inspector position is, if I remember correctly, if we manage to get this season of suspicion going on, and we have a hunter, someone who's hunting us, they can use the damning evidence we made to damn us. I seem to remember that was a thing, which I always thought was really, really weird. Uh, well, we can work on the damning evidence some more, except we don't have any reason, because they're all dimmed, so we can't really work on that, so let's paint. I mean, you can't really paint that much with just having one passion, but ah, it's fine. Perhaps, eventually, prove yourself to me. Let's talk. Okay, so now we have a dread here, which is fine, because the dread goes here and this will go away. Now we found mall and shop, that's also very nice. 
but that really not really what we were really looking for because we want to find Oriflames first. Because this time I know exactly what are the books we want to buy from Oriflames, so going there first is a better idea than going uh, to Mallens to spend all of our monies there. I've grown stronger. Okay, so now we have a stronger physique. Um, we probably should also start trying to increase our reason and our passion here. Okay, there goes the dread. We don't need to care about that. There's something reminiscence for us as well. Uh, let's dream about our temptation sensation. Should I dedicate myself to my purpose or focus my efforts elsewhere? Yes, we want to focus our efforts elsewhere, but we're going to need something else to put in here, though. A reason or a passion, right. Okay, we have a sickness here now, but we can dream that away as soon as we've done this dreaming. Uh, you're looking for some bleak thoughts. We do not have any bleak thoughts going on around here. Got a glimmering for painting. Okay, so if we put reason in our dreams, my goal is enlightenment now. No, we don't want enlightenment as our goal. Okay, so passion is then what takes us to... Or is it health? Okay, yeah, passion. It must be passion that puts us to... The power temptation, which is where we want to go. Okay, let's study some, uh, you know, no, where's the, oh, the passion is exhausted. Well, let's study reason here then. Increasing our basic stuff is good. Uh, let's uh, explore with our health, try to find our flams. And did we find it? Yes. Okay, but we don't really have any money. But I still think we're gonna go to Oriflam, see if there's something we can... Oh, we really need to work on our inspector's position here, though. Uh, put some reason in here, put... I don't know, the damning evidence in there, pursue the investigation. What are you selling? De Horis Book 1. Which is, in fact, a book me we want to buy. Uh, we And, to be perfectly honest, <laughs> Once we got this, we don't really need any more lore books from here. Well, there's the uh, ones that have uh, Forge law, and we'll probably want to get those uh, because, you know, we're going to want to be a Forge cult here. Okay, let's dream this affliction away with this vitality so that we don't accidentally lose any health. Okay, more fleeting reminiscences and exotic cravings, which isn't really going to grab much here. What's that? Resentments. Huh. Interesting. Oh, it grabbed. Oh, right. It grabs him so he can increase. So, yeah. We really need to get this guy in prison just because his rival's ascension is so high. That is gonna be a problem. Oh, come on, people. Don't beat on that book. It's not that interesting. Okay, there's an erudition for us. Let's get... You know what? Let's study this passion here so that this glimmering won't be wasted. What you doing? Rivalry! Here is another who would ascend before me. Independent occultists will try to monopolize the attention of the hours. They may also conduct other schemes, whether you like it or not. What's this? A murderous scheme? Traces left by rivals is to move against an enemy. Who are you trying to murder? Me? I mean, the I'm the only one here who you could murder. My investigation has turned up no new leads. Ah, uh, that is fine. Uh, let's work with our strong physique here right now because I want to have the reason available. Okay, there's the Horace book one. Right. Uh, let's just keep going to our flops because if we find, for instance, thumb from here very quickly. It will be very nice. But for instance, this book we'd no longer need. Because uh, this would only give us Winter 2. And we don't need Winter 2 for anything in this run. So yeah, we're just gonna let that go. Oh, what you doing? A scheme to murder a hunter is afoot. Well, we don't have any hunters yet. A rival intends to end a hunter. This may be to my advantage, but it may also draw attention. Yeah, that is true. Okay. Get our health back there from the dreaming. Now, where is our passion? Oh, right, our passion is here, so let's wait that until it comes back. And then we can dream it with uh, our temptation and get a better temptation. 
Trists and Interludes, Season of Silence coming up. Okay, there's the Passion. Uh, let's use the Glimmerings to get more Passion. Let's get the Contentment from here. Let's dream about our Temptation Sensation with Passion. My goal is power now. Yes, power is our goal. And we will forever be. And back... No, you know what? We only have three funds here. Let's not go back to Oriflom. We're really gonna need to get some more money before there's any point in going there again. Okay, a bit more funds. Let's work on our inspector's position. Work on the damning evidence. Use a bit of reason. Uh, let's actually wait until we can use a bit more reason as well. Or, you know what? No, let's let's not. Because we're gonna want to study that reason prediction so that we can use this erudition to increase our reason. Uh, so you're trying to grab a hunter, but there are no hunters here, so that is fine. But is this? Oh, this is in Latin. Bloody hell! That means we need. To, gonna need probably need to buy another book. Okay, so there's our temptation power. I have refocused my intentions. My predecessors will have the power of remaking, a power that empresses generals, physicists could only dream of. So shall I, though the power might sear me. Though the power might sear me. It has occurred to me that I hold the key to power. This card will allow you to win a power victory. If you upgrade far enough, dream about it might advance it or change it. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so now we have... There are more windows in my soul, but sunlight is not the only thing that passes through a window. So we gain a bit more passion, so we can start painting now. Uh, oh man, that erudition is gonna be wasted. Unfortunate, but hey, what can you do? Okay, we have all the things we can find from the city, so there's no need to uh, explore with our health at this moment. What are you looking? Solving the case! I've turned over my evidence to Assistant Gen Director General of the Suppression Bureau. Okay, so as soon as Salibek comes out of here... Well, he won't come out of there apparently, so we don't have any culprit to, you know, in prison, so nothing's gonna happen with that, which is kind of unfortunate. Okay, let's study some more reason to get another erudition incoming. I provide the suppression bureau with enough evidence to make an arrest, but there's no one to arrest. Yeah, unfortunate. But we'll work with the. Wait, did the evidence go away? Well, bloody hell! Well, now we're gonna have. Wait, can I just keep this here and the timer? Interesting, just putting it here even without starting the thing keeps the timer like uh, stopped. Huh, well, let's use our investigators, uh, inspector's position, and let's study on. Oh, we don't have the reason. Right. Uh, well, then we're gonna have to work with our stronger physique just so that we don't lose money while not doing anything. Okay, another erudition, so let's work with the erudition's get even more reason. And then we can soon work with our inspector position again. Okay, funds there. Now, let's work with our inspector position. Uh, Saliba as a subject, use a couple of reasons there. Get some more evidence happening. Because we, yeah, we really, really want to get rid of this guy. Or I mean, Maybe if we could get him into our call, that'd also be nice. Oh, wrong kind of attention again, but that shouldn't really do anything, because we have nothing over here. Okay, more reason for us. Uh, so, right now, oh right, we do not have the skill to read this book. So let's just go to Oriflames. We're working now, so we should have enough money if there's something. Well, introduction to histories, we are most definitely going to have to buy that. Because that will give us the secret histories and we can find an expedition from that and maybe find something good. What's this? Night Terrors. Why is there Night Terrors? Progress! Okay, a bit more money, which is always good. Let's use the inspector's position, let's use the evidence, let's use a bit of reason and start working again. And we get some contentment because no one is after us. And we get the introduction to histories, so let's read the introduction to histories. 
17th century mystic and antiquarian Claude Hersault describes divergent incidents in five major histories. The prologue warns at length of the inequities of one Julian Cosley, a former colleague who Hersault now describes darkly as a worm of worms. It seems Cosley advised Hersault early in the writing of the book, but Hersault later became suspicious. And back to our plums as well. And now they're selling. Oh, the Queens of the River. So more secret histories, which of course we're gonna buy. And the exotic cravings are here again. Time's passing, season of despair is coming. Are you gonna give me some despair? You look like you're gonna give me some despair. Yeah, you give me some despair or dread. Slowly, my clenched fists relax. I'll slide back into sleep, but something will remain, like spiderwebs in the corner of the room. But luckily we have the contentments here, so with that contentment we can dream this dread away. And you are rivalry! Here is another who'd ascend before me. Uh, so what are you trying to do? A bold scheme. Okay. And what are you selling here? Oh right, you're selling that book. You want some more money for that? Come on, people. It's not that interesting. You don't want to bid on it. Progress! Okay, so now we have the damning evidence. Let's work on the damning evidence with the reasons we have here. And so what are you doing? Arrival is considering expedition. Well, luckily, we do not have any expeditions open here. My rival seeks tools and lore for their own ascension. Her soul identifies blood, silver, design, and the worms as the central axis of each of the histories, and claims that the so-called second history is the true one. Well, now that we have an occult scrap, let's talk on the streets about esoteric matters. And we got the Queens of the Rivers. Good, so we can read that as well at this point. A surreal contemporary play by the enigmatic Monica Mendina, in which the queens of the rivers are murdered one by one. The queen of the Vistula is poisoned, the queen of the Dnieper chokes in a fish hook, the queen of the Targus is burned alive. Oh, and let's head back to our plums. Of course, we'll see if there's something good they're selling there. Traveling at Night, Volume 1. Hmm. Well, this would allow us to go through to the uh, uh, manses, as with this, but we don't speak Latin, so yeah, let's buy this book. We can read it and then we can head to the manses. Uh, what's coming up next? More Seasons of Despair. There's a fleeting reminiscence that we don't really care about. Oh, more bitters for this book. Come on, people. I spend way too much money on there already. Solving the case. Okay, can we now solve the case? Will Saliba come here? Okay, Saliba is here. So now he goes there and we solve the case. We're finding an acquaintance. And here we get an occult scrap. The culprit, it transpires, is the audience. The surviving queens are directed to execute whatever audience members do not escape. A surprisingly lucid epilogue suggests that the correspondence of the river names with historical events does provide clues to secret histories behind our own. Right on, and... Do you want to study anything? I mean, we could just study more passion to get more glimmerings happening. Okay, and I won the auction. Yay! I mean, we only have one more funds left. That's so that not that yay at this point, but uh, maybe it'll be fine. Maybe it'll be fine. Okay, solving the case. The suppression bureau holds their trials in closed court, and they are not merciful. My quarry disappears from the world. I have earned myself a promotion. An inspector's position. I have a senior position in the capital's police force, although I have been seconded to suppression bureau. We get seven funds for them. Okay, nice. And a favor from authority. And we're gonna get a new rival. Another miscreant. Will it ever end? Can we ever call the law, the city, the world safe? Probably not. Okay, what can we work with here? Oh, just with the tentative evidence. Oh, wait. We can work with the favor from authority? A kind of ascension. I want favor with the authorities. I can use this to win myself a promotion to a place in the hierarchy of the bureau itself. Yeah, this is a minor victory ending. So if we did this, we would basically win this story here. But no, we're not gonna do that. Of course we're not gonna do that. We're gonna start a cult. I mean, at least try to start a cult. 
I think we're gonna need, yeah, we're gonna need a follower to do that. So here we get a follower, just a hanger on. Well, it is the forge hanger on, so that's fun. So if we talk to the hanger on to get, oh, but no, no, no. We're gonna need the forge law because we wanna start the forge cult. So there's really no point in starting the cult before we actually find the forge law. So let's just head to Oriflam's and uh, kind of depending on what level the new rival is who comes out here, we might not even want to put them in prison immediately. Or, you know, not work on the damning evidence immediately. And again, there might be, like I said earlier, there might be the problem where the evidence that we create will actually be used against us. If we, like, manage to get some mystique on the table. Holy crap, I forgot to check what they were selling! No, with my luck, it was thumb that they were selling there right now. Oh, bloody hell. Why, did, why, why didn't I check it? Ah, uh, portions and proportions. No, we don't need this because this would only let us get to the uh, first door in the mansions and we have the ways to get to there, you know, with traveling at night. Oh, it always feels so bad when I forget to check what's in there. because oh, I always think it's gonna be thumb. A troublemaker! Okay, so I don't care about imprisoning this troublemaker, so once we have damning evidence, we're not gonna work on that damning evidence at all. We're only gonna be working on... I mean, can we just work on you and create more and more of that sensitive evidence? Because I don't really care about having lots of that on the table. I mean, we'll stop working here once... Uh, once we have started our own cult, of course, we're gonna stop being a police officer then. But for until we get our cult, we are gonna be working on it. On what is contained by silver? Hey, this one we want, because this has Lantern 4 lore, which allows us to get to the second door in the manses. Also, we could just speak on the streets about occult scraps, get more people in here. Okay, and we won on what is contained by silver. Nice. It is in Greek, unfortunately, so we cannot read it immediately, but uh, that's fine. We're gonna find Greek at some point. Progress! So, we made tentative evidence. Let's make more tentative evidence. I mean, I feel like this might be like... Well, oh, Season of Suspicion is coming. Okay, well, we'll see if this tentative evidence, like having tons of tentative evidence over here, is actually gonna be a problem or not. Okay, there's a glimmering lesson learned for us, so... We're gonna study a bit more passion here still. Two more passions, uh, get the glimmering lesson learned, get... Uh... What were they selling there? I don't remember anymore. Yeah, get another passion. Okay, he grabs the mystique there now. So someone is meddling. Oh, the War of the Roads. I th think this is one of the books we want to buy from here. Okay, more progress, more tentative evidence. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be bad, I think. Let's do it some more. We grab tons and tons of tenant evidence. Who is here? A weary detective. There's always someone who doesn't understand or who understands too well. This troublemaker may seek evidence on my activities to share with the authorities. This gentleman would much rather be left alone with his pipe and his illustrated London news, but no! Apparently some conjurer of abominations has to be hunted down like a mad dog and apparently no one else can find the time. Well, I'm finding the time. I mean... Come on. We're both police officers. You don't want to do this. Okay, so we got the War of the Roads. Let's go back to Oriflames. And then I actually think, let's just check what we get from Oriflames. In this, the humors of a gentleman. That we do not know. And uh, let's get that one more glimmering. This is gonna give, ooh, old unhappy four things. So let's get one more glimmering incoming. And then let's end this first episode here and continue from this point in the next one. I'm a cop. Uh, this is being called the simulator unflinching order. Goodbye world. Thanks for watching. See you next time.